They called her work worthless. Barbara McClintock sat alone in her Cold Spring Harbor laboratory in 1948, studying corn kernels under a microscope. While other scientists chased fame discovering DNA structure, she quietly documented something impossible, genes that moved. For decades, she watched corn patterns that made no sense, kernels changing colors in ways that broke every rule of genetics. The scientific world laughed at her, called her crazy, said genes couldn't jump between chromosomes, but she kept working, 40 years in her small laboratory garden, documenting every detail. She never fought back, never defended herself, just continued her patient observations. Then in the 70s, molecular biology finally caught up. Her moving genes were real. They controlled genetic expression and drove evolution itself. The foundation of modern genetic engineering came from this quiet woman studying corn. She won the Nobel Prize, but by then, she'd already changed everything. True discovery doesn't need recognition to reshape the world.